What's up everybody, welcome to a new video and today we will take a quick look on Shiba Inu because for the past couple of days this coin is again pumping like crazy and also I'm watching here uh, some new interesting trading setups that you can take advantage of of course if certain conditions are met. So yeah, if you are interested about the exact trades that I'm planning to take here, definitely watch this video till the end. But before that I would like to ask you if you like my videos and you like my analysis. I will be really happy if you did like and subscribe button and also if you type some comment under the video because it will simply help the algorithm to reach out my channel to a new people. So yeah, thank you guys for doing that and enjoy today's analysis. But before that, I would like to invite you to my Discord trading group, where I am sharing everyday crypto analysis on Bitcoin and other altcoins that I'm currently watching. So if you want to copy my exact trades or if you want to just follow my analysis, you can join to this group and link to join is in the description or in the comments. Let's start today on a weekly time frame. You can see that here, after we broke uh, this resistance of this of this previous uh, triangle, we had here like absolutely crazy pump. You can see that the pump was more than 100% of the net market move. So yeah, congratulations to everybody who, who took this move. But right now we are testing another really, really important resistance, which is between levels 0 0.0214 and 0.0214. 209 and you can see that historically this area was for example important support here 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 and after here like after breakdown and resistance confirmation we had here a pretty big drop so yeah that's the next important area that i'm currently watching okay so how to take advantage of this of this resistance area First of all, I want to see how this weekly candle will close because I want uh, to this candle close above this resistance area because, for example, you can see that the RSI is currently on the level 80 on the weekly time frame. So from a long time perspective, this coin is starting to be over but but for example historically you can see that in this pump we had here like several bullish weekly weekly candles so yeah definitely something similar can can happen right now so that's why i want to see here first of all a support confirmation and if there will be support confirmation on a, on a weekly time frame then i think that this can be let's say a really really good opportunity to open here a long trade because the stop loss will be will be really small because this resistance area is not that is not that big and also the potential take profit targets will be really big so the potential risk reward ratio yeah this trade can be really really good so the exact trade can look for example like this as i said i want to see here support confirmation on a weekly time frame so right now i'm definitely not planning to open here a long trade because yeah this candle can just be a fake out and the market can do something like this so yeah i just want to avoid it but uh, stop loss in this case if there will be actually that support confirmation stop loss i would put somewhere under this uh this resistance area of course there is pretty high chance of getting liquidated but yeah i simply think it's worth of taking the at risk because uh, the potential profit is uh, is really really crazy so if you will for example take your elastic profit target somewhere under these like previous candles of course you can put it uh, to the to the current all-time high this will give you even even better risk reward ratio because yeah this is just a meme coin and definitely it can pump to like these previous heights so in this case you can have your risk reward ratio like 48 and estimated uh, net profit around 209 percent so uh, this potential trade is like absolutely crazy but again keep in mind that uh, it, there is pretty high chance of getting liquidated even if there will be that support confirmation and if you for example want to have let's say bigger stop loss you definitely can you can place your like 10 percent 11 stop loss of the of the net market move but then the risk reward ratio will be simply like not that good but uh, definitely also in this case take multiple take profit targets so some of the profits definitely take under this high then under this high this high this high and then you can save some big to the elastic profit target so if we will choose the more risky setup which is in my opinion much much better because yeah i simply like having good risk reward ratio then from the like risk reward, risk reward ratio 46 it can be i don't know like 35 something like that which is still like absolutely insane and you won't find setups like this every single day so yeah definitely keep an eye on it on the other hand because this is like a really important resistance it can also give us an opportunity for a short trade so if this candle will be will be just a fake out, you can uh, you can place the you can place the stop loss above this current high that we created during the fake out, but this won't give you that good risk reward ratio because yeah, 
let's say somewhere around this i want to see my uh, my potential last take profit target so probably it will be better to have just let's say more risky stop loss again so you can have at least like 6.5 risk reward ratio so if you are looking for some short setups this is also an option but i think that the long scenario that i just showed you on that uh, on that weekly time frame is much much better and let's now take a look on the lower time frame and uh, i want to use the four hour chart i would definitely like to give you some interesting trading setups on this lower time frame but you can see that here we had like absolutely crazy crazy pump so the only area on the four hour chart where i would consider let's say opening some trading position will be a long position in these order blocks so from the current price the price needs to drop around like 56 to 70 percent of the net market move so yeah in my opinion the simply the four hour chart is not tradable at the moment so the only potential trading setups that i'm currently watching are on the weekly time frame and let's say also on the daily time frame because if you for example I don't know want to want to open here let's say more risky long position you can wait just for a support confirmation on the on the daily time frame definitely i wouldn't go for a lower like 12 hour i think that the that the daily is like uh is like perfect for this so yeah uh, you can also wait for a support confirmation on the daily time frame and then trade the long scenario that i showed you also, I need to say that there are always certain conditions that I'm watching and that are need to be met before I'm opening any of my trading positions. So yeah, if the setups that, uh, that I showed you in, in today's video is not valid, then I'm simply moving to another coin because yeah, we have interesting trading opportunities in this crypto market every single day but yeah guys if you like my analysis and you for example want to copy my exact trades you can join my discord trading group where i'm sharing um, analysis every single day and link to join is in the description or in the comments but yeah this will be all for me for today thanks again for watching and i will see you in the next video see ya